going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today's video is about the winner. Once again, the winner of the highest console sales for the month of January. And you may have guessed it. It was PlayStation. I'll drop a link in the description. PlayStation 4 sold the most in January, but Xbox One had a great month. The PlayStation 4, once again, was the top of the sales list in January, but Microsoft had a solid month itself. The Xbox One had its best January to date, Microsoft said, and added that the Xbox One was the only console to see year-on-year -year growth during the month. The Xbox ecosystem saw a 21% increase in time spent playing Xbox One games as well. Microsoft didn't say whether the Xbox 360 backwards compatible games and Xbox Play Anywhere games played on PC counted in that number though. Also on the gaming side, Sony told GameSpot that four of the top five best selling games in January were PlayStation 4 releases. That combined with the lack of any marquee Xbox releases in January makes its performance that much more remarkable. The PlayStation 4, on the other hand, saw the release of Yakuza 0 and Gravity Rush 2, and while Resident Evil 7 was multi-platform, it definitely received more attention on the Sony side of things in terms of both VR support and advertising. With February set to see more exclusives like the massive Horizon Zero Dawn and the much smaller but still console exclusive Berserk and the Band of the Hawk headed to PlayStation 4, don't expect that balance to change much. Sony's system is so dominant that it's kind of boring. It's like watching one athlete or sports team steamroll the competition for years on end. While I like my Xbox and PlayStation equally, and have been playing the latter almost exclusively for the last month and a half, I'm having more fun watching Microsoft scrape its way forward, making games big and small. The system had a few good months this summer until the PlayStation 4 Pro came out and the holidays showed up. Sony resumed dominance as usual, but it's good to see Microsoft making games on Sony in this area, however small. Competition is good for both consoles and gives us features like PlayStation Plus and Xbox Live games with gold, Xbox One backwards compatibility, and Play Anywhere, and more. So yeah, this is awesome news, really good news. Uh, probably, God, it's going to be such an exciting month for me. I'm a huge fan of the anime Berserk. If you've not seen Berserk, you need to definitely watch that. Berserk and the Band of the Hawk, Guts, Griffith, it's coming to PlayStation 4. Is it exclusive? I'm going to definitely go balls deep into that. Also. Who's not going to be playing Horizon Zero Dawn? That is going to be an amazing game when it drops next month. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Are you playing on Xbox One? Are you playing on PlayStation 4? What game are you playing now? Because guess what? We are fueling these engines. We are fueling these super machines by funneling them our hard-earned dollars. Right now, PlayStation's in the lead, but Xbox, once again, having a great month. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, share your videos, and support the channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer. And I'll see you guys next time.